Hello guys, welcome to another short video in this ReactJS series. In ReactJS, the ternary operator is used to conditionally render the content in JSX. This is one of the conditional operator which is similar to if condition or else condition or some other. The ternary operator takes a condition and returns one of the two values based on whether the condition is true or false. In the context of ReactJS, you can use the ternary operator to conditionally render different JSX elements such as divisions, paragraphs, list items or any other JSX elements. Or you can conditionally render different values based on these conditions. So let's see this one with an example. For that one first, let's open code editor. Let me populate some code here instead of this return statement. Here you can see I have defined a variable by name is logged in and I have assigned true value to this one. And we have written the ternary operator condition here. We are checking the value of is logged in. In this example, if the value of is logged in is equals to true, the content which we have defined here that is you are logged in message within this paragraph that will be rendered in the applications page. Otherwise, if it's false, the content or message which we are displayed here, that is please log in to continue, that element or content will be rendered in our application. As earlier we have set is logged into true, when we go to browser, you can observe the message which we have added in the true condition that is being displayed here, that is you are logged in. If you go back to code editor and change this value of this is logged in false from true, the content which we have defined here that should be displayed in our browser. So let's save this one and go back to browser. Now you can observe the message that is changed as the value is false here, the second statement that is being displayed here. So this ternary operator helps and make your JSX code more concise and readable when you need to conditionally render based on certain conditions. In some real cases or real time scenarios, by using this conditional statement or helper function, you can improve the code readability. So that's it about this ternary operator in ReactJS. Thanks guys for watching this video. If you like this, please click on like button, share it with others and subscribe to my channel.